Hello everyone. Today you will be learning about a parallelogram. Let's get started. So, what is a parallelogram? It is basically a rectangle except only two of the sides are a little bit tilted to the right or the left. Always remember to name a geometric figure. The most important thing to remember about a parallelogram is that its opposite sides are equal and parallel to each other. It has four vertices and four edges. Finding the area of a parallelogram is way too easy. We just have to multiply the base by the height. Now we look at the formula to calculate the perimeter of a parallelogram. A and B are any two adjacent sides. Here I have taken these two. So we'll add both of them and multiply their sum by two. A problem for practice. Given is a quadrilateral with opposite sides equal and parallel. Side DC is 10 cm and AD is 8 cm. The perpendicular drawn from vertex B to side DC measures 6 cm. We are asked to find the area and perimeter of the figure. So seeing the part opposite sides equal and parallel, you should get a clue that they are talking about a parallelogram. Also to confuse you guys, they gave a complex term, perpendicular drawn, but it is basically the height. Let's see the solution. There are several things given to us in the question. DC, which is given equal to 10 cm, is the base. AD is given as 8 cm. And the height is 6 cm. In the first part, we have to find the area. So, we'll multiply the base by the height. 10 into 6 gives us 60 square centimeters. To calculate the perimeter, we'll add the adjacent sides 8 and 10 and then multiply the sum by 2. So 2 into 8 plus 10 will give us 36 centimeters. A quick recap of what we learned today. A parallelogram is a quadrilateral with its opposite sides being equal and parallel. Its area is equal to base multiplied by height and its perimeter is twice the sum of its adjacent sides.